this is Vivian Moody Perry coming to you again from Healthy Earth for Five Boys. And today, um, and, well, first of all, I know um, many of you have seen my videos now about how I had five fibroids, one the size of a six month fetus, and the other for the size of grapefruits. And now I want to just talk to you about a different topic. It's about diet and how important it is to change your diet when you're also taking the herb to shrink the fibroids. I want to read to you an email, an email that I received from one of my community members. And um, she said, thank you so much for your videos, Vivian. I have five boys. Two years ago, I shrunk them by changing my diet and exercise. I became a vegan for six months and it worked. By started eating, by eating, <laughs> okay, forgive me here. But I started eating or went back to my old lifestyle and they grew back. I'm very glad I found your videos on YouTube. And I need to take control of my body. Thanks again from Linda. Okay, see, this wants to just validate what I've been telling people in my other videos and emails that just taking the herb, the red clover, is not the end to all. You have to change your diet as well. The food, the unnatural, the growth hormone laden food makes the fibroids come back. They come back. And you can't stay on the red clover for forever. So it's it's very, very important that you have to make the sacrifice and change your diet as well. And again, it's, you know, you have to get the organic food and um, make sure it's all natural. Even if it's not organic, it's all natural. And there's a, a little tip that I want to give you about how you know whether you're paying for organic food or natural food. Um, it's on my other video, but if you did not see that other, other video and you see this one first, you have to look at the numbers. All produce, there's a number on your produce. And the organic consists of five numbers. It, it doesn't have to be any, any sequence. It's just five numbers on your organic fruits and vegetables. And when you see that number, that means that that is organic. Anything that does not have five numbers, anything that's less than five numbers, that's conventional food. That means that that may be the food that uh, it's, well, it's just not organic. So um, that it may, the farmers may have to use pesticides or whatever it is they need to use in it. But that's not always the case because sometimes you can get food from the uh, farmers, your neighborhood farmers that grow natural food. Um, but they just don't mass produce it. So you have to take that into consideration when you're buying your vegetables and fruits and your meats. The meat is very important. That's where the growth hormones are in the meat. It's in the meat. In the, um, the vegetables, you just have to worry about like pesticides and that sort of thing that they spray the fruits with and the vegetables with to keep the bugs from um, destroying the, the crop. So, but as far as the growth hormones, that's usually in the, that's always in the meats and the um, poultry. So, I hope you find this informative. Keep coming back for more videos and um, I'm going to do another video uh, regarding how to clean your food um, if you can't get organic. Okay, thank you, God bless, and don't forget, go to my Facebook page and uh, it's called Vivian Moody Perry, How to Shrink Fibroids. Give me a like sign, sell some love, and you'll get a free chapter of my ebook. And tell your friends and families about my videos and my website. Thank you again. God bless.